Hey everyone here from Tunnel Vision TV and in today's tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to do noise removal using Nuke. So first of all I'm just going to bring in some footage and I'm just going to drag and drop this in and it's automatically going to create a read node for me. And then I'm just going to connect my viewer to that clip. Alright I'm pressing H on the keyboard just to resize it in this window. And uh, this was shot at 800 ISO on a Blackmagic 4K production camera. So if I zoom in here, if I set this to 100%, um, you'll see some noise, quite a lot of noise. And I'm going to quickly show you guys how to remove this using Nuke. So first of all, what I'm going to do, I'm going to click on my clip and then I'm going to press tab and then type in denoise. So denoise and then press enter to create that node. And um, I'm just going to zoom out here again. Let's go to fit width. And then you'll see there's a little box here, this little square here right at the bottom. And that's your noise um, area that it's going to analyze basically. So you can drag this to resize it and then also click in the middle and reposition it somewhere in your shot. And try to find a, a spot where you've got quite a bit of noise. And then it will basically analyze that section and it will try and eliminate that noise throughout your image. So first of all, if we double click on this denoise node, you'll see on the size we've got some options. And uh, first of all, under source, you can set this to film or digital noise. So because this was shot on a digital camera, I'm going to set this to digital. And then all these other settings I usually leave as default and it gives me really good results. And then you've got your denoise amount, which is basically the main parameter that you're going to use. So if you increase this, it will try and remove more noise, but it will also make your image a little bit blurry. So usually I try and set it below one. So I'm going to set this to 0.5. And already we can see the image is a lot cleaner. So if I just zoom in here again to 100% and if I just pan around here a bit, um, you'll see it's quite clean. And if I just click on this node and I press D for disable to just toggle this uh, between on and off, you'll see that's without the denoise node and that's with it enabled. So it's pretty good. And um, then basically we can just zoom out here again. And um, then you've got all these other options here like smoothness and sharpen. So if your image looks a little bit too soft, you can always try and increase the sharpen parameter here. And this will just add a bit of a sharpen filter to your image. I usually leave this at zero, but if you want to, you can just play with this value and see if you get a better result. So that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Give me a thumbs up if you did and give me a thumbs down if you didn't. And uh, also let me know if you want to see more Nuke tutorials or more After Effects tutorials. And also remember to click on that subscribe button to get notified of any new tutorials. So thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Cheers, bye.